Hello everybody, my name is Lorenzo and I like to play video games. And as you can see, we are playing more League of Legends because I love playing League of Legends and I love bringing League of Legends videos. But I have to sadly I have to tell you that this is probably going to be the last 5v5 game for a while. Just because of the new client update that Riot did, it, the, there's an issue where with memory leakage, the FPS drops dramatically at like the 20 minute mark so since these games tend to go on for longer than 20 minutes that makes it so the game starts to lag really really badly as you'll be able to see later on in this video so instead I will be bringing you Dominion videos because Dominion is usually about 10 minutes long which is a good length you know it's not gonna drop any frames and also I don't have to edit a 10 minute long video uh, gameplay because it's already 10 minutes might have to take out a few of the things, but, you know. Actually, no, I don't. I don't have to take out anything. It's a 10-minute game. So that's going to save me editing, which will hopefully get you guys more videos. Um, just always, always, always a plus, because I love bringing you guys videos. All two of you that watch. <laughs> uh, but I'm not here to talk about League of Legends. Sort of. You know, I did, but I'm not really here. That's not the main topic. The main topic is old games seeming new. Oh. And uh, what I mean by that is a game comes out, like, at, a game comes out and you don't play it till, you know, three years later, let's say. Um, everyone else has played it and you've heard good things about it and you finally get around to playing it and you realize, oh my god, this is like the greatest game of all time. Um, that actually happened to me with Uncharted. Um, uh, I heard about Uncharted, I've known about Uncharted for a long time, I've just never played it and it you know it, it just never was on my you know big to-do list of i need to get uncharted because i just recently started getting into more game genres other than shooters um because for a long time i only played shooters whether it be call of duty or battlefield or um kill zone and all those other things uh so um the third person action games weren't really big on my priority list but I got it for Christmas, I got the double pack with Uncharted 1 and, and Uncharted 2, and I played them, and I have to say I dig the crap out of the first Uncharted game. It is so mind-blowingly awesome, um, and it, j just the color palette alone, just the first time you walk and you see that color palette, it's just so beautiful, the greens and the... The way that the leaves, they like they, they blow in the wind, and you if you hit a bush, like it'll bend down, and it'll pop back up and swing a little bit because you ran over it, and it's so freaking beautiful. It's a beautiful world that Naughty Dog has created. Um, the partly due to the fantastic voice acting in the game, um, which you know Nola North, it's so awesome. Uh, he he plays that character perfectly. Um, along with every other actor in that game, there's there was no actor where I was like they phoned it in, like there was none of that. Like they were all just so fantastically awesome. Uh, so I definitely dug that, it, and the story the story was so well paced. There there was actual tension. You you felt like these characters were actually growing a bond, that they had a bond to begin with, and that they had history. Like it wasn't just like oh. You're a, you're an evil villain that we're just supposed to, you know, automatically know that you're a villain. You know, you, you could tell that they've had a run in the past and they, you know, they were like, yeah, I don't like you very much. Uh, so that definitely was good. It definitely does remind me of those old Indiana Jones movies, which is kind of the whole point of Uncharted, but so good. Um, and and the, uh, the story length was like six to seven hours, give or take, one of those. Um, but I, I had no problem with it. I know some people may have a problem with a six hour game because, you know, meh, it's only six hours, you know, it's not, it's not going to last me forever. Well, no, but I would, I would much rather have a six hour game than a, a six hour fantastic ride of a game than a 20 hour so-so game that I have to really push to finish. Um, cause that's no, that's no fun. I'd rather have a good time with it than have a long thing. It's like a movie. I'd rather have an hour and a half good movie than a three hour long sucky movie. No one likes a three hour long sucky movie. 
unless you're like artsy and fancy and pompous um, but yeah it was perfect and there was never a point in the game where there was like how in some games where you play and there's like that little that there's a part when you're like oh hey I think this is the point where I'm gonna stop there was none of that I just kept playing and playing and playing until I realized hey my stomach's growling I haven't eaten I'm gonna go eat food um, so there, there is that which is always it's always a good sign when it, the game sucks you in so much that you just want to just keep going through it and you don't ever like stop going um, so yeah, that's definitely good and it, 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 had a, it had everything it had the, the great characters the great story the chemistry it had love romance action um, it even had horror I was not expecting horror um, it was it's kind of terrifying I'm not gonna spoil it for people that have not played the game but people ha that have played the game you know what I'm talking about you know the the catacombs you know the catacombs um, yeah that terrified me to death I was I had my gun aimed every every corner I took it was blah I'm surprised I made it that far it was just terrifying uh, yes I went high-pitched um, so yeah if you haven't played the Uncharted games, I highly, highly recommend you go and get the Uncharted Double Pack because it is just so good. And I'm so excited to play the, sec the second game because I have, I've heard that it's like amazing, mind-blowingly amazing. And if it's better than the first one, I don't know what they did. Like, it, the first one was just so good and the second one's supposed to be better, so that's just awesome. And so I cannot wait to play that and I will definitely let you guys know what I thought about that after I have finished playing that through that um, because I'm, I'm, I, I just want to go do it so yeah that's my spiel go get it it's like 40 bucks $20 per game maybe even 30 bucks don't really know um, but it's pretty cheap so you know for two games that's pretty that's a good price for two fantastic games um, so go definitely go buy it um, yeah. All right. So I guess that's my spiel on a on, on a new old games seeming new. So I guess we'll just talk about the gameplay. Um, yeah. As you can tell, we've been really pushing heavily. Uh, as we're as I'm in the base right now. Uh, I've done a few mistakes though, which is why I'm four and five, which is not a very good kill death ratio. Um, it's not something that you like to see. I like to see like a, you know a ten and two. That's definitely good. I like ten and two. <laughs> Uh, and here uh, is another stupid mistake. I decide I'm gonna stop an attack even though I can't actually do anything. I do get an assist, but the death wasn't really worth it. Don't know why I stopped. I should have just kept running and let the, my teammate attack. Uh, yeah, so for the most part, this game is coming to a close. I believe I have one more assist and one more death. And then I cut away to the winning, to us winning the game because everything else is boring. So, yeah, I guess if you like, so I guess I'll close it out. So if you like the video, make sure you leave a big thumbs up because that makes me happy. I do a little happy dance every time I see one. Um, and make sure to comment anything, anything you want to comment on. It's all good. I'll, and I will try and respond to it unless it's something really ridiculous, like an advertisement, then I will block you because no one likes ads in the comment section. Um. But yes, most definitely leave a comment and I will definitely respond to you in any way, shape, or form that I can. Um, and if you like what you're seeing right here, then please subscribe because I will be releasing more content. And more content is what you look for when you subscribe. Yeah, so make sure you do that. That makes me happy. I always I do an extra happy dance every time I see a new subscriber. So yes, please do that. And here, this is kind of a BS type move. I don't know how he didn't die. It's very annoying, but he didn't die. And I kind of cried. I made me sad inside. I teared up. <laughs> so, yeah. Alright, I think I'll just let this game finish because I'm just kind of babbling right now. So, I will see you guys later. Peace.
Victory!